All right, let's talk about some vocabulary here. We're going to talk about polynomials and polynomial vocabulary. And I already know I left something off of this, so we'll add it in. Degree. Think about the word degree outside of a math context. You've got a different couple of things. Degrees, maybe as a measurement of temperature. Tells us how hot something is or how cold. How about with um, types of burns, like a first degree, a second degree, a third degree burn, so burns. How about with, when you're in college, there are different degrees that you can earn. You can earn an associate's degree, a bachelor's degree, a master's degree, a doctorate. And how about in karate, or I don't know if they do this with other, um, what did they say, martial arts? The different types of black belts, right? There's a first degree black belt, a second degree uh, black belt, stuff like that. So belts. So these tell us how kind of how powerful different things are. If in education, I know that a master's degree is better than a bachelor's degree or more powerful, you know, required more education. A third degree black belt is better than a first degree black belt. Now in math, it's we're going to be talking about monomials and polynomials. The degree tells us who has the highest exponent. So in math, it's based off of the highest exponent. In math, it equals the highest exponent. And here's what I forgot. The idea of poly. Poly means many. So when we're looking at polynomials, we're looking at a bunch of monomials all put together. We're looking at a bunch of single term pieces all put together to make a many term piece. The idea of poly. Uh, let's see, poly, polytheism is the idea or the belief in many gods. What's another poly? A polytechnic, like a polytechnic college or high school means they have many, usually, technology classes, poly, polygon, many sides, poly, poly, polypropylene, I don't know if that's, I should look that up, that's a, what is polypropylene, is it a type of plastic, and is the poly in that mean many, many propylenes, I will look that up for the next video hopefully, polypropylene, okay, I could be totally off on that. Here we go. So find the degree of this polynomial. And I just told you, just told you, oh my goodness, can I speak? It is based off of the highest exponent. So I have two pieces here. I have an f to the third. And I have a 6 to the, if, if there's nothing there, it's a 1. So what degree is this? Is this a first degree or a third degree? It's based off of the highest exponent. This is a third degree polynomial. That's it. I look at all the exponents. I figure out which exponent is the highest. That's my degree. Find the number of terms in this polynomial. Well, let's count them up. One, two, three terms. This polynomial has three terms to it. Okay, find the number of terms and the degree of this polynomial. Okay, well, number of terms, that's easy, right? One, I have two terms, and what degree is it? Well, this is a second degree, that's a seventh degree, this is a seventh degree. It's based off of the highest term. I don't add them together, this isn't a ninth degree, no, it's based off of the highest exponent of a single monomial. All right, okay. Now, these guys get a little bit more specific. 
When we look at these, a first degree polynomial is called a linear And that's because when you graph a first degree, it makes a line. A second degree is called a quadratic. And a third degree is called a cubic. So I just look at the degrees, and I can determine what to call the equation. There's our first one. Oops, wrong direction. Let's take a look. Like a look. Ah, let's take a look at this. What degree is this? Well, this is a fourth degree. Well, a quadratic is a second degree. It's not that one. A cubic is a third degree. It's not that one. A linear is a first degree. This is a none of the above. There's no magical name for a fourth degree. Or at least I don't know what that magical name is. I only know these three right here, linear, quadratic, and cubics. All right, so I was going to look up polypropylene. OK, I'm going to look up polypropylene, and I'll get back to you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye. Polypropylene.